Oh, hello there, kind internet viewer. It is now Wednesday and it's bank holiday here in Denmark. So that means that I'm off work and I'm at what I consider my real job. <laughs> Today I continue my Etsy adventure. I hope to finally open the shop and start working on it. It's not going to be officially open today. I don't think there's time for that, but I hope to do some account settings. And um, yeah, I mean, I've never done this, so I don't really know exactly all the steps that are included. So. I'll start by hopefully opening the account. I'm hoping to get some drawing for a header done. I also need to do some drawing for Instagram. <clears throat> I need to do my laundry and eventually, maybe, hopefully, some video editing. There's not much time, so probably not all of these because I've also promised my boyfriend to go out and skate later today. And I also want to do that because we have now nice weather. Unbelievable. So I gotta make use of that. Actually, I already tried to open the shop, but it turns out that I already had an account with the email that I wanted to use. I guess another attempt I made some time ago and never went anywhere because basically all that exists is the account and it says there is shop associated with it, but there is absolutely nothing, no listings, absolutely nothing, it's just the account. Which annoys me because I want to start brand new and I don't want to use this account, I don't want something that's from a few years ago. So I have now changed the email associated with that account and I hope hope that I can use my actual email to open a new account and the other one I'll just delete because I don't need it, I don't use it, I'm, I don't even know why it exists. I mean I know because I tried to do this before and I just, I just didn't go through with it because too much doubts, I don't know and I still have them and uh, I hope I don't get back to this two years from now discovering that I have account already and Oh, this is so embarrassing. Anyway, so I'm going to see if I can uh, use this email. If not, I'll have to figure something else out. And let's just hope it goes smoothly because I don't need extra roadblocks. I have too many in my head already. Wish me luck. thing is now done many more to go i have finally made an account i have made my first listing and i guess it's going to be easier from now because i will just copy and slightly modify the other listings because they're very similar products so i don't think that i need to do very different things but this has taken me so long it's now four i started at like 10 in the morning is that normal and I'm still unsure a lot about a lot of things. I feel like everything I'm doing is wrong and like my prices are too high and my shipping is weird because I've never shipped and I don't know and I'm basing it off of information from the post website but you know it's weird to do it when you haven't really actually done it in real life and there's so many more other things to do and it feels like this is too difficult and why am I even doing it and there's so many other great products out there already and I'm not gonna be making any money off of this even if there are sales because these are just not that big of products I mean I don't really know um, I'm not saying that you should give up every time when things are hard and certainly great things can come out of things that are hard and so many people have already done this and they're not necessarily more skilled or smarter or whatever than me. I don't know why I feel like that. I feel like I have this huge resistance to doing it because I'm scared, because I'm not sure, because there's so many unknowns and 
I know that other people feel that way too but like why do I feel like it's some kind of sign that I shouldn't be doing it I don't know maybe it's just because I haven't really had any chance to take a break and relax in a very long time you know working 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 and maybe I just need a break or I don't know I'm going to continue because I still want to do it but I don't know, I guess I just want someone to tell me if this is normal and if I should continue. And of course no one can tell me that and even if they do, I shouldn't be doing things because somebody told me to, I should be doing it because I want to, because that's not one of those things that you absolutely have to do, you, you do it because you want to do it. So, yeah. And in the meantime, I've also found out about some openings for some summer art markets that I really want to apply to. But I just know that I can't get the time to do it this month. So if I didn't see, I don't think there is any deadline because it's going on throughout the summer. But I want to put some more time in my application since it was denied before and I feel like I can probably make it better. I want to make some new product and I just don't know when I'm going to do all of this. And I want to do the application after I'm done with this Etsy business because I want to get that out of the way. And also I feel like it's going to be more trustworthy if in my application for the market I can show that I already have some kind of shop even though there probably won't be any sales at the time because I just don't think that these come that quickly. And I mean, how do you even get your first sale? Like, do you just get your friends to buy something? I guess that would be a way to get it started. I don't know, this is so scary, <laughs> so difficult. Anyway, if you have or have had similar experiences, let me know. I just don't wanna feel alone in this, I guess. Throw me your encouragement or yeah, if, uh, if you can't do that, please just don't do anything. <laughs> so yeah, I'm going to continue on this now. No, actually, first I'm going to have a lunch because it's four o'clock. And then I will continue. So I asked one of my friends who has an Etsy store, is it normal to spend the whole day making your first listing and then still feel unready and second guess yourself? And she said, yeah, it's normal. And then you spend the next day editing and, uh, and changing things up. So how do you people do this? <laughs> oh, crazy. Welcome back! It's been maybe two or three weeks since this vlog has started and there haven't been much development since. I've been working and now I'm supposedly on vacation but I'm called to work again in the weekend because work never stops. Anyway, there have been a bit of a change since then. I've brought my external second monitor from my office that I'm not using anymore. So it's gotten a bit crowded here on the table and I wish I can just go for a second table, but that's not going to happen anytime soon. So we'll have to deal with the space we have. Anyway, back to Etsy business. I finally have the time to go back to Etsy and First thing I'm going to do, as a little bit of foreshadowing suggested earlier in this video, I'm going to go back and edit that first listing with some extra information I got in the meantime, mainly about shipping, but maybe I should look again into tax as well, because I don't know the first thing about tax. Tax? Tags? Honestly, sometimes when I edit these videos, I'm not sure what I meant to say, so... If you don't understand what I'm talking about, I'm with you. I feel you. Neither do I. Such is life. So, it's kind of cold today, but I feel like hair down is a little, a little too warm on my neck. There we go. The freelance bun. I'm going to go back, edit my first listing, hopefully add a bunch more listings, and also 
hopefully today finish this vlog because it kind of bores me and I want to move on to something else. So let's do this. Look, I have now three products in my shop. Ah! I'm happy to report that it's going much quicker now. I feel much more relaxed about it and I'm sure there will be another crisis, but it's not going to be today, I hope. So I'm going to continue stocking my shop until hopefully it's finished and can be released. But that's also not happening today. And I also want to finish this video because the next one is going to be a lot more fun. So I hope that you'll join me next week for that. And until then, have fun!